one of the aircraft we've been flying for uh, multiple years now. The pusher motor in the back right now to accelerate, the fans are starting to slow down, the wing has all the lift on it. Here as we're getting to the north end of the runway, the aircraft is going to start to slow down, it's going to go back into a hover. What's, once it's in a hover, uh, the aircraft is going to do a nice little pedal turn. Uh, we want to make sure that everyone here gets to see this aircraft while it's up flying. We're going to fly all the way back down to the south end of the runway here. So I understand that, uh, that both these aircraft, especially your sixth generation aircraft, the autonomy is a part of, of your mission as you go forward, but you have a strategy to fly before you go autonomous, I believe, right? So tell us about what, where is this innovation, where does this future kind of take us from this? Uh, yes, so you're asking about the autonomy portion. Years ago, we used to fly Generation 3. It did have a man on board. Uh, we made the decision a long time ago we wanted to go the autonomous route. Uh, so right now, the aircraft is flying itself. There's no pilot on board. We do have a pilot on the ground. He's monitoring the flight, but he does not have a stick and pedal. This is uh, an aircraft just flying on its own. So humans are still very much a part of the operation. They're just not on board. Correct. Right, right now, we're... We're having a wonderful flight team here. They're all the way out from California. Uh, they're monitoring the flight, making sure everything's going as planned. Uh, aircraft just uh, did one more pedal turn. It's going to come all the way back to center stage, uh, where it's going to land in front of the craft. So you talked a little bit about the uh, the human in the loop, if you will, that's, that's monitoring the system and, and flying in. You talked about the autonomous flight of it. Just for what we're seeing here today, is that monitoring station like actually did you program the flight that we're seeing ahead of time or is he doing that kind of live like hey i want to turn here no today we're flying a pre uh, pre-done flight plan absolutely so as it's starting to slow down here as we're getting back to center stage the aircraft's going to do one more pedal turn uh, we do want to show off some of the hover capabilities it's going to do a 270 degree turn to the right uh, and then face the crowd for a landing Wow, that is absolutely fascinating. The, the stability and the controllability is uh, very obvious there. And, uh, and like you said, the quietness of it is just spectacular, Jay. Even in a hover, this is the loudest portion of flight. It's very quiet. We can barely hear it up here. If you notice, Cora just did a little hat tip to the crowd, and we're going to come in for a landing. Wow, that, that is spectacular. Luke? What do you think? This is cool, huh? I'm up here halfway speechless, to be honest with you, watching this uh, very unique demonstration by WISC. How about that, everybody? Let's give it up for the WISC and uh, the WISC company and, of course, their Generation 6 aircraft being displayed here as part of Innovation Day uh, here at AirVenture 2023.